Well, what is going on everybody? Welcome to the first video on this channel, Intrinsic Kicks in Apparel. I've been on YouTube before talking about sneakers and streetwear and clothing, so some of y'all may recognize my face. I wasn't even sure, I've been feeling like I wanted to come back for a while now, but I wasn't even sure when that was gonna happen. But anyways, I just got some tax credit or something in the mail or something like that. So I took a bit of it and I bought a couple pairs of shoes and this right here was one of them. Everybody has had a pair of these. So I couldn't think of a better shoe to be the first shoe that I featured on my new channel. So I ordered this shoe from Journeys. I've already opened the box. I, I don't know what I don't know what to call this. I, I mean it's not it's not I wouldn't call this a full-on sneaker review. I mean maybe it's somewhere between a sneaker review or a pickup video. I just wanted to talk about this shoe. I wanted to share it with you guys. I love this shoe. Every sneaker enthusiast or sneakerhead or anyone who just really appreciates sneakers should have a pair of these. This is like the first sneaker that ever just like went mainstream that like everybody knew everybody had a pair everybody wanted a pair they originally came out in the 1920s as basketball sneakers so i think it's safe to say that this is probably the most classic sneaker of all time so what we got we got the converse chuck taylor all-star high in the classic black and white colorway. We gotta show the inside of the shoe or the medial side as you uh, sneakerheads like to say, because that's where, that's where the, uh, the iconic classic Converse Chuck Taylor All-Star symbol is on the inside of the shoe, not the outside of the shoe, on the inside of the shoe. All right, so here we go. We got the Converse Chuck Taylor All-Star high in black and white. Uh, very quickly, I'm just gonna talk about these shoes and then I'm gonna show you some pictures in an on foot and that's about it. I just wanted to share these with you guys. This shoe, as far as tech goes, as far as sneaker technology goes, I mean, these are pretty much unchanged from the original. They look a little bit different, but not much has been done to these since the 1920s. So they're very basic, very, very basic yet comfortable. Like no arch support, you know, no airbags, no freaking boost. You got, you got yourself like a rubber outsole and a basic, basic insole, a floppy ass canvas upper, this toe cap, which kind of sucks sometimes. It looks cool obviously, but sometimes when I walk in these, I can like, um, I can feel that. I can feel my toe rubbing against that, but it doesn't really cause any pain. So overall, they're super, super basic, yet super, super comfortable and pretty cheap. Even at full price, they're about $70 Canadian. Um, so, and I mean, come on, man, they look amazing. This is the most classic sneaker of all time. Like this shoe just looks amazing. I mean, you just, you gotta have a pair of these. And one thing I do want to note about these, and it's really bizarre that they've never changed. I guess now it's like they're classic, so they don't want to change it. Converse fit humongous. I wear anything from a nine to a 10, basically, in sneakers. And in these, over the years, I've learned, I, these are a size eight, and I still have a little bit of a little space in the end, in the toe. Converse are freaking humongous. Like, honestly, I size down a full size needs. Trust me, trust me, trust me, if you're not trying these on, if you're ordering them online, full size down, you will not regret it. I promise you, you will still have a little bit of space, full size down. Anyways, man, I'm so excited about these. I just wanted to share. Thank you so much for checking out my new channel. That's about it. I'm gonna get you guys some pics, an on foot of the shoe, and stay tuned. I got I got more to come. I'm back. Like I was gone for a bit, but I miss it. Uh, I'm back. Thanks so much for watching, and uh, take care.